Would you like to learn how to crop your images in Lightroom or have you forgotten how to do it? Well, this short, simple, fluff-free tutorial is just for you. My name's Steve, welcome to Behind the Tripod and let's get straight into today's short tutorial. Okay, so we're in Lightroom now and this is the image that I want to crop. So the first thing we need to do is come across on the right hand side and you'll see the little crop icon here. We'll click on that and that brings up our crop uh, menu here. So we've got a few things to look at. We've got our aspect ratio here. So at the minute it's clicked on original, which means wherever I change or crop, the original aspect from the picture will be the same. So let's just bring that back where it was. We can then click on that and that will change the aspect ratio. So we might want to do a square crop. We want might to do a 16 by nine crop. We can do lots of options here. But what I like is to go back to original, click on this icon here, which is your padlock. At the moment it's locked, but if we unlock the padlock, it means we're free then to change that crop in any way that we see fit. So I'm just gonna bring that in a little bit tighter around those bones to highlight the castle in the background. We can change the angle as well. So if you take an image that's a little bit bit off when you come to edit it we can change it and if you look it makes it smaller or larger so that you don't overlap over the outside of the image and end up with any white or blank spaces this is quite a straight image so I'm quite happy with that okay remember with Lightroom everything you do is non-destructive which means it doesn't change the original in any way at all so we can come out of there now um, and we can maybe go to edit we can do a few of our edits that we would do playing around and if we decided at any point we wanted to go straight back um, to our crop we can and then we can change it it's non-destructive it hasn't changed the original um, so that gives us a few options there well, I hope you found that useful and if you did please leave us a comment give us a thumbs up and subscribe for more content just like this and I'll see you very soon in another video